Hello everyone, this is Livin' Dead, and I have another WAD playthrough to bring you. This time we're taking a look at Crepitations by Soulless. This was posted earlier on the Doom World forums, and it is a Otex GZ Doom map, so I'm pretty excited to check this out. I saw a couple snippets of a preview video by Hack3180. Um, but very quickly into the video, I decided to stop watching it because I wanted to play this because as you can see This map looks awesome um, I have played a previous work by Solus. Uh, it's a map that goes by the name of festering cesspool That was also a an Otex map and that was pretty good as well. There was a lot of interesting surprises it made good economical use of the space and um it was fairly doable in terms of difficulty. There was a few bogus moments where there was like a whole bunch of Hell Knights and stuff. Um, you know, just maybe some of the some of the traps began to feel a little bit too cluster, you know, uh, dense at some point. But uh, I mean, that 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 was just like looking at a couple of the things that may have kept it from feeling like a you know m mostly perfect exper experience. So, um, what I mean to say is that. Uh, it was very competent, and I'm very eager to see what this is because, I mean, already, take a look at what we've got going on here. So we start off on this little entryway, and we drop down into this kind of little square. I mean, it really looks like almost like a village square of some kind, almost. And then there's a street down below, and we can kind of start exploring these buildings here. So let's get going with that. Um, crepitations. That's an interesting name. I don't really know what that's supposed to mean. If it's sort of like a portmanteau, it's like a combination of a couple of actual words. Crepitude, crep. I don't. Re I don't know what that um, part of speech or that that word part means. I assume it has something to do with like death or decay or something. Ooh, here we go. Some much-needed shells. That was oh. Wow, you can even like open up these different windows and stuff. There's a, actually a lot going on here. And uh, this is pretty exciting so far. I have a feeling we're in for a long one. Given how many monsters we've got here and the fact that it seems like we're going to be going room to room for a lot of this. <laughs> okay. A little toilet humor. Oh. I was the zombies the whole time. Wow. This is an insane amount of detail. Yeah, I mean, look here, look at this. Let's just look at this real quick. We have I assume this is a mid texture. It's pulled away from the wall, so it actually look, looks like a towel that's like hanging there, and then the sector behind it is like darker, so it looks like the towel is casting a shadow over it. This is incredible. For a tiny little bathroom in... Jesus. Uh, in this map. I mean, this is incredible. Ooh. Yes. Yeah, right. Okay. Um, looks like you should be able to get in there. Oh! Fuck, that was a bad spot to save. A secret? Aha! Uh -huh. Very nice. Opportune heal and a much needed resource in general with the Berserk, so... I like that uh, Soul has found a way to incorporate the classic secret book switch to reveal the secret on the bookshelf gag. Um, oh boy. And there's a lot going on here. Alright, let's... Uh, I would prefer to not try to fight from that angle, so I would like to go back outside and see if I can find a better spot to engage some of these enemies from. It looks like, man, there's just so many ways you can go through here. Oh, man. Man. I, I, I go for the 360 no-scope on the guy. Well, I guess that was more like a 180. Yeah. And I miss just enough to make him a two-shot. Sucked. Oh, man. That was not a good dodge. 
Starting to waste some of that berserk that I found. Alright. Um, looks like you can jump down into this well from here, maybe. Oh, there's two of them down there. Alright. Let's get this guy with the uh, chain gun. Probably would be more economical to try to get these guys to end fight, but I don't know who else is down here. I don't really feel like running out when, yeah, there's bound to be some hit scanners tucked away or something to that effect. Okay, so that is a shell box I can definitely get if I just go back up here, but I want to see, can I actually jump in this well? It seems a little bit far away, but I feel like that angle is possible. Maybe if I do it from here. Oh, I was so close. Let's try it one more time. Or two or three more times. We'll see. Start it back. All right. What lines up with that? What lines up with that? Uh, oop. Kind of lines up with the corner here. So if I try to aim for that, let's see. Let's see how we do here. Oh. Haha. <laughs> I know. Shouldn't. Uh, shouldn't have crouch on. Can I, actually, can I actually get down in there? I just have to know. Okay, totally worth doing, even though it's just a chain gun. <laughs> yes, I may have cheated just a little bit, but I proved that I could get up there. I just, for some reason, didn't go into it. So, you know. Okay, that was just a bad jump. I kind of uh, pulled it a little at the last second. I was not confident in the direction I was going. Okay, whatever. I'm over it. I know it's there. I landed on it once. Um, very interesting. Shipping bricks to this place to, to build it or something. This is just incredible detail. Let's just stop and look at this. I love the way... Um, I mean, a pink and orange skybox. And then the way that the skybox is set up, this first kind of vista... Or at least when you're up there, it's like you you mostly see the pink, and it just contrasts so well with all this orange and gray. I love this color scheme. It's not really something you see a lot in Doom wads. Even like Ev Eternity didn't really have much that looked like this, if I recall correctly. This is this autumn village type of thing going on. Okay, can't go there. This is a skull door. Where can we go? Do I need to try to go through the buildings? That's the armor. This isn't anything, is it? Okay, I didn't think so. Alright, let me just uh, take a second to figure this out. Through here. Okay, so this is... Taking me to a place that is not... Yeah, okay. Whoa! Who do we have here? Some new guys. They have a lot of health. Oh, it's civilians! Wait a minute, I was killing Doom guys! They were not enemies, were they? Uh-oh. That was not good. Alright, let's uh... Remember that we have the Berserk. Get over here, buddy. Man. I think it's shooting so far. Hadn't been too crazy yet, but... I mean, we got a lot of room to go, so... No need to get that worried about that yet. Oh wow, it's just like missing a piece up there. That's great detail. Uh, maybe I'm being uh, assisted by the dynamic lighting. Is that a torch or is that possibly a lost soul behind this wall? <laughs> I guess I'll find out in a little bit when I can figure out what building I can go into.
Red skull. Oh, yes. Ambush? Ambush. What's coming down? I was right. Oh, wow. An unexpected early cyber demon. And not a lot of ammo compared to what I'm going to need to kill this guy. So I am in for a fun time, I think. Yeah, let's get out of there. Alright, so as long as I remember to stay away from that door, I will be totally fine. Nothing to worry about. Nothing at all to worry about. Kill him. Kill him, you weaklings. Thank you, my friend. Woo, that was close. Okay, has he wandered off somewhere? Oh shit. Oh shit. Well, he's he's back nearby somewhere. Okay. Um oh. What do you got? What are you doing? Oh, yes. Oh, and double yes. Alright. With a super shotgun, I will actually feel capable of killing. I should have picked up the damn... Arm, uh, rad suit, but I did not. Okay. Ooh, that was a bad flick. There we go. Alright, now, um... I guess I didn't fare too badly, but that was a big mistake not grabbing that rad suit earlier. Could have saved a lot of damage. I wouldn't have had to been as frantic during that fight, but oh well. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Lesson learned. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> um, that was fun. Okay, so Cyber Demon, did he wander in from there? Yes, that's exactly what happened. He just took a little sniping shot at me. The bastard. Oh, did he make a friend? Cool. I'll let you guys have fun with all that business then. You count me out. Nice, uh, generous, generous amount of health, which is, ooh, always nice for a trap-heavy type of map, I would feel like. But, um, yeah, I mean, aside from that errant Cyber Demon rocket, this hasn't been too, too difficult. Uh, um, uh, so far it seems FDA-able. Is he gonna do anything? Are you just, like... Piss the cyber demon's not your friend anymore? Okay, well. Sorry, but it has to end sometime, buddy. Okay, so what did I accomplish? Okay, I opened. Oop! Some monster closets is what I opened. Okay. Yeah, let's, uh. That's a bad shot. That spider kind of messed me up. Oh, of course. A little recovery. Just a little bit. Now...
Oh, crap. Alright, Doom Guy, I will leave you alone this time. I just thought you might be an enemy, but I will let I will let you survive, so that was my bad. Can I can I free him? Oh, I did not really need that. Or is he just uh traumatized? Hey man. Can't find a way to open these cages, so uh just sit tight and maybe one day I'll be back. I don't know, no guarantees. Um, ooh, a supercharge. It'd be nice to figure out how to get. Oh, piss. Oh! There wasn't really a whole lot to do about that, I just... I guess I should have taken the hint and just started shooting as fast as fucking possible, but... That's a... Where is the arch vial? Oh, he showed up, like, instantly last time. Can you get over here, guy? Fine. Stand right there. No st stupid asshole. <laughs> nice. This is just, uh... Again... I just love all this detail here. Whoa! <laughs> I like these secrets. That was a that was just a, a fun surprise. Very nice. Given a break with with the uh, the barrel, if you can take advantage of it. I love the, love the placement of barrels so far in this map. Okay, here's our buddy. This kind of reminds me of the um, Strider fight in uh, Half-Life 2 Episode 1. When you're escaping from City 17. You're in like the warehouse and you gotta deal with the Strider roaming around. Except, you know, in this case, I do have the choice to maybe try to kill this Cyber Demon, but it doesn't seem like a good idea. Just, I don't think I'm going to have a good shot at him. Unnaturally. But maybe I should just think for a second, and if there's a good way to take a couple of pot shots at him, I, mean, I could just come out here and roam around, right? Yeah, fuck it. Let's just kill him. Let's do a little saving. There's plenty of ammo out here, and I have enough shells to kill him, I think. I assume he's taking at least a little bit of infighting damage, maybe. All right. That is a big problem solved. Unless he would have been very helpful for some infighting later on. Could have created a big problem. But I guess... Uh, I guess it's too late for that now because... Oops! So now... Let's go back and deal with those... Ooh! This is... This is handy. Hell Knights and everything else that I woke up in that other area that are probably hanging out somewhere nearby. I assume, did these guys just not figure out how to get to me? Hello? Hey, fellas, can you not get up the stairs? These guys can't get up the stairs, so they can't follow me. Really? Wow. That was uh, some good luck. I really want to leave that there. Oh no! Doom guys, we gotta get you out of here. Um.
Oh, you son of a bitch. I was doing so well. Wait, did the Doom guy punch the demon out? Hell yeah, dude. I mean, I totally heard a punching sound and then that demon died and I was not doing anything with it. Someone's still roaming around here. That was a fun little trap. Hell yeah, dude, you're the man. Sorry I killed your buddy earlier. I thought he was a bad guy. Um, okay. Well, all said and done, that could have gone way worse. Doing pretty good so far. Man, every time I see this... Like, I know this is supposed to be lava, but it just makes me think of, like, liquid gold for some reason. Like, molten gold. It would be lovely if it wasn't so damn hot. Um, okay, so I got... One area open? Does this go down? Does this... Oh. Interesting. What did that accomplish? It feels like I'm missing something. Um, oh. Interesting. Oh, I don't like that. That's a hard angle to get. Oh no. Oh, give me a fucking break. All right, I'm sorry. I'm just not a big fan of that kind of thing and it's kind of annoying honestly. So, I choose not to engage with it. Oh shit. Where are you? Take that, buddy. Okay. That's a short elevator. Gonna have to go into some austerity measures for my shells. This is cool. It's kind of changed up. There's like this sort of hidden industrial side behind this charming veneer that I like. This is such a fantastically thoughtful map so far. Ooh, man. Anyone else? Oop. Man, I, uh... I feel like I should have found at least one or two more secrets by now. I like that there's a lot of them. It, it, uh... It's a good vibe to have for a map like this. Lots of secrets in it. Because it's totally a map that you really want to explore. Even though this has been, for the most part, like a very linear map. There's really been, like, one critical path through it. Um... So, you know, you think of it in terms of exploration, but it's a very linear exploration. But still... It doesn't really feel like a major detraction from that so far. So you have some nice uh, presence of secrets and kind of gives you a reason to still poke around and see what you can find. God, this... You are a son of a bitch. And he really...
Okay. Something is hinting that this might be a useful armament to have. Um. Oh, I've made it back. So, oh, is this like a radio that they were calling in backup and I'm the backup? That's pretty amusing if that's what happened. I mean, there's a lot of dead Doom guys here, so... I assume they're like, please! The demons are coming to our lovely pumpkin fest. And I was just a little too late. I had to brush my teeth. And it made me delay just enough. Oh, that was so bad. Fuck. I mean, I knew the risk I was taking. Um, but I was a little arrogant thinking that I was not going to... That I was going to kill him fast enough. So, oops. Yeah, I mean, this is not the kind of fight you, you would want a cyber demon roaming around. So I think I made the right call. Seems to be a pretty low pressure... Si or uh, arch file to deal with unless there's another one hidden somewhere else. Uh, um. Ah. Where are you guys? Priority number one. All right, he's dead. I know there was two. I feel like I didn't kill two of them, but maybe one is dead. Oh, man. Not the ammo I actually want to be out of ammo for. I mean, the weapon. I guess that made sense both ways. One just had some rather redundant phrasing. You guys would make good infighting friends, I think. There you go. Ow! That was a major hit! What the hell was that all about? Man. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, wow. Very opportune. I just, like, saw that by accident. Very nice. Well, and, and uh, okay, so now with the red skull key, I feel like I have a few different things to explore, right? Oh, this is a backtrack. Okay, that's nice. Gives me the opportunity to come back and get this armor if I left it here. That's smart thinking. I like that a lot. What else do we have? Um, I do want to grab this shell box up here real quick. That was accessible by going. See, okay, here's a perfect example of that pink contrast. Man, that is just... Again, I just absolutely gorgeous looking. We've had some very awesome, good looking wads coming out lately on the Doom World forums. There was Lullaby, and now there's this map. And I mean, Lullaby is almost a little bit more of an art piece than this one is. Nothing that is not meant as an indictment at all against Soulless and the effort that has been put into this map. Not really trying to make a comparison between those two maps, just uh, pointing out that, man, it is a good time to be a Doom player right now. Especially if you like wads that are very cool looking. Alright, so I cannot go out of here. I don't remember where I saw that other red door. Was this meant to indicate that I'm supposed to backtrack this way? Um, I don't want to come back here again. I don't want to deal with that. I want to pretend it doesn't exist. Um... I don't remember. This is going to probably have me turned around for a minute. Uh, no. There wasn't a, there wasn't a, a red door here, was there? I didn't think there was. I feel like I, I, mem I remember seeing one, but... I just don't remember where. Um, let me get back to the square. Yeah, this, this is like the square, the town square here. Um, this way, maybe? What's in here? Okay, just the tr just a trap. Oh, here we go. 
Well, hey there, partner. Oh, no! I have to reload now. I can't... I cannot accept that. That was... That made me feel bad. I know they're supposed to be, like, maybe just the citizens of this town, but I love the idea that it's just, like, all inhabited by Doom guys. So... When a town full of Doom guys is enslaved by the demons, which Doom guy is gonna step up and save the Doom guys? Well, it's gonna be Doom guy. I don't know, that was a little dumb. That was off the cuff. Could be workshopped a little bit. But, uh, I think we can vamp on this. Shit. Man, that was a nasty little closet. Is this just a trap? Okay, so I have opened the way back here. Oh, fuck me, of course. I got him, okay. You think I wasn't going to go after the pain elemental? No. Pain elementals get my attention almost as much as our arch archfiles do. Oh! Piss! That's exactly why, man. Infinitely tall lost soul totally screwed me up. I was like weaving through all that too, man. I was like darting through traffic. And then I got froggered by a goddamn lost soul. Ugh. Oh well. That's kind of uh, what happens in this game. Did I leave behind any health? Yes, that I. Yes, I did. Just a little bit. Um, alright, I opened this way back. Oh yeah, there's a red key this way at the beginning. Um, there's gotta be some health line about too, right? Maybe? I won't spend too much time backtracking through here, but I just wanted to see real quickly. It's fine, I'm sure I'll get some more health going forward. Anything over here? Oh, I pressed that switch in the middle of that fight, and I don't think I ever figured out what it did. I just kind of forgot about it because I was technically still battling. So, what was it? I pushed this? Is there another one somewhere? Oh, no, 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 duh. It opened that supercharge. Um, which, I think I'm just confused because I don't feel like I've... I feel like I... Should have more secrets? Maybe not. Okay, whatever. Let's go forward. Let's go forward for real this time. <laughs> that was absolutely delightful. I was surprised in the best way possible. Man, I have to know how much time to, ooh, a red regular key. But yeah, how much time did this map take to make? Because gosh, there's, it just, it just got so much going on. That was where I came from. Um, anything up here? No. I am very curious to know what that key unlocked. Here we go. 
Maybe I'll get a cool weapon at the end. BFG, maybe? Uh-oh. Okay, oh, that was a monster closet. That is like a little stove top almost what it looks like. Man, this, God, I just love all the detail in this. It fits, it's done so competently too. It just looks so good. That's a highly amusing means for that trap to be sprung, by the way. I love that you, like, immediately are like, okay, we gotta go duck into the side here real quick. Oops, oops. Oh, I made a mistake. Oh, that is a mistake, too. Okay. Hi there. This is a mess. Oh, man. Oh no. Ha 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 Okay. Sorry, uh, sip a beer. Okay, there we go. I can has rocket launcher too, so let's try it. Let's try it, buddy. Uh, okay, how do I get past him though? Because I still need him to be dead. I need him to be did. Uh. Whoops. <laughs> that was very poorly done. Dart over here. Grab this. Grab this. Guess we're just gonna. That's all this was? Aw. I really thought I was gonna be getting like a BFG or something. Maybe there's more to it. That could be not the only red key. Door. <laughs> that is. Okay. Um, okay. What happened here? That seems like a, some kind of weird glitch. Maybe it's because it could be potentially my compatibility settings. Who knows? Head on boom compatibility if that makes a difference, I think. That's usually what I play on. Yeah, boom, strict. Maybe that was uh, the reason why. Ooh, I like the way that this looks. Sorry. I'm... Very cool looking. Yeah, I always get a box of shells, or uh, rockets. What is this? More lost souls. Too many lost souls. I like how choked with monsters this place is starting to become. And there's been quite a good density all throughout, but I just love these closets that are just like packed full of imps and stuff. A lot of good excuses to bust out the rocket launcher and just blow stuff up. Wonder what that did. Oh, open this up. Okay. That has got to be one of the most ineffectual arch vials I've ever seen. Please, I want my arch vials to be capable of killing me easily every single time. No remorse. Ooh. That would be nice to know how to get. So, uh, am I really meant to just forget about that cyber demon for now? I was kind of, oh, not expecting that is what I wasn't.
Ooh. Secret. Oh, yes. I'm very surprised that was that easy to find. But I will not argue because I'm sure I'm going to need it for whatever I end up getting into up here. So let's just wait a second before we grab this, though. Hey, guy. Yeah, you... Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Making me waste my damn supercharge. Woo! Can you come over? Okay, yeah, that works. That that doesn't. That was bad. Yeah, whatever. You make mistakes and then you try to recover from them. Okay. All right, well, I'm still leaving that there for now. And if I... Uh, hopefully I don't need to come back through. So now it's going to happen. Am I missing something? I really feel like that invulnerability, like... Am I going to want it for this? What happened? Did I just close that? Oh. <laughs> Interesting. That wasn't too bad. Okay, good. Not locked in here. Alright, the, the uh, fact that that other cyber demon is still alive, though, kind of bothers me. So, I would like to... Ooh, that's the exit? Okay. Am I going to come back... Yeah, let's do a little exploring here real quick. Um, that let me back out here. He's still just hanging out here, huh? That's gonna be an annoying enemy to try to kill for 100%, which uh, I guess I won't be doing. <laughs> Maybe, we'll see. Okay, so yellow key area, so I guess we're going this way now. <laughs> oh, I like that's like a temporary switch. Very surprised there wasn't anything back there to kind of mess me up. Oh, have I already been here? Oh, I'm back this way. So, what am I doing? Oh, okay. I feel like I remember this trick in uh, Festering Cesspool, you have to run across a gap, and then when you get right to the other side, there's like a... I think it was like Barons and an arch file, Something like that. I don't know why I remember that specifically, but I do. Oh. <laughs> okay, that was weird. Okay. Ugh. Just more pain in my ass. Well, I guess that wasn't too bad. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Whoa, no! Fuck, really? God damn. What is blocking me? Oh, this thing. Yeah, uh, probably 
does not think about boom or uh, infinitely tall actors with the uh, where that is located. So that's uh that's on me for picking that though, but that is something to consider. Um okay. Whew, man, what a nasty trap. And somehow I pulled through. It was the power of friendship got me through it. Something. I don't know. Okay, where am I now? I'm back out here, which means I am near... where I kept the invulnerability sphere. So I'm really interested to now see... Ooh. Some goodies that I left behind. Nice. Oh! What's this all about? A lot of cacos. Big old cloud of them. Has there been a time in Doom where it's not fun to shoot at a, a, a caco cloud with like the rocket launcher? I don't think so. Ooh, a computer map. Like lets you go back and get secrets that you missed. It's like almost begging you to figure out how to get to that invulnerability sphere if you didn't. Did I miss this? No, this is just a trap that was opened up. Um, how do you get here? I see that. I can't shoot it. Maybe I will. This is not the actual exit, is it? Oh, really? Wait a second. How do I get out here? That was kind of surprising. Um... Oh, that's going to bother me. How do you get this? Oh, man. Well, I don't know. Um, in the interest of uh, keeping this... That, that happens multiple times. So is that a reason for that? Hold on a second. Uh, okay. Well, whatever. Yes, I did it. Map complete. 98%, 50% secrets, 43 minutes. That's not too much... The recording isn't too much longer than that. Man, that was incredible. I do actually want to pull this back up real fast and just... Let's just take one last glimpse around. Because that was a pretty cool map. I love this exper experience. Everything that you see, for the most part, is used in some way. There's a lot of good contrast between wide open areas and shorter area, or like narrower areas. The visuals are just incredible. It is just packed full of detail in every single room. There's so much going on. Flickering lights, interesting drainage pipes, uh, you know, excellent usage of mid textures to create these overhanging fall leaves. I mean, God, it's just fantastic. This is a this is a phenomenal work. Um, I had a lot of fun playing this map. Uh, absolutely got to commend Solus for the amount of work that must have gone into this here and the just the excellent visual style. One of the best looking maps I've played in a long while. Um, that includes considering things like Lullaby. I mean, again, I'm not trying to just make people compare them, but uh, I do want to point out that. I'm just constantly impressed by some of the stuff that you see, and this is no exception here. Been playing Doom for as long as you have, and then you still see maps, you're just like, man, this is just so cool. So uh, props to Solus for just finding a way to surprise me so thoroughly with a, such a delightful map. Great use of variety in the way that the combat was. There's traps, there's open battles, there's interesting, I mean, the way that the cyber demons were used, I love the way that they were used and that they were just like 
massive problems to deal with in otherwise like regular types of combat scenarios. Love that type of consideration. Um, the way that the traps were used did not seem like crazy excessive. It wasn't like literally everything is a monster closet, but you know, it had a it had the expected amount for a map that looks like this. Um, one thing I have to complain about is the fact that instead of just rescuing all the Doom guys, you just like leave? So, what's that all about? Anyways, thank you for watching the video. If you like this map, and I highly recommend it, I think you should give it a download, give it a try. If you like it and you if you played and you like it, leave a comment and let Solus know that it was good. You know? Um, a, the download link is going to be in the description below. And uh, I thank you very much again for watching. Let's do an outro speech while we have this constantly obnoxious m noise playing in the background. Thank you so much for watching the video. I will see you next time. Take care.